Hello, we are going to look at more questions on arithmetic. So in this question, we are given a value for pi. And the question is to find the answer to this in two significant figures. So two significant figures. Right. Now we are allowed to use the calculator. So I shan't try and uh, do this by hand. Let me take out my calculator. Let's see. see if this works. Now I'm going to do um, a fraction, which is the 22 over 7. That's the fraction. Okay. And I'm going to minus pi. Now, let's see. Pa pi is there. So I do a shift, all right, and uh, pi. So there we are, that's 27, 22 over 7 minus pi. That's the answer. Right, on the calculator, that's the answer that I got. I got 1.2644 and a bunch of other numbers with a times 10 to the minus 3 on it. So it depends on the setting of your calculator. It may give the answer as that, with the 10 to the minus 3. Or it can also give the answer as... Um, now, 10 to the minus 3 means divide by 1000. It means 0 0.0012644 and so on. Or it can give the answer as, as that. So whichever answer you get, when we say two significant figures, the way to give that answer is to start from the left and look at the digits one by one. Right, the first zeros that you, if, well, if the first few digits are, are zero, you ignore them until you reach the first digit that is not zero. So you count that as the first significant figure. And if you want two significant figure, you count one and two, and and we round up the rest, round off the rest to the second significant figure. So in this case, that means right, that's a 6, so I'll round up to 3 then, and I drop all the rest. So the answer is 0 0.0013, and that's the answer to two significant figures. Let's look at the next question. There are some balloons. There are some red balloons and there are some blue balloons. Alright. Now, 
these are in the ratio of 3 is to 4 right and we, we are given that the total number of balloons is 84 question is to find the number of blue balloons right so we have the ratio 3 is 4 total 84 to find the actual number of the blue balloons we add up the two numbers in the ratio 3 plus 4 is 7 we think of it as 7 parts of which we have 3 parts red and 4 parts blue so to find the answer we find the number of balloons in each part we do 84 divided by 7 that gives let's see 12 all right and the, there are four four parts of that is four, four parts of the seven parts are blue balloons so to find the number of blue balloons i must then take this uh, 4 and the 12 and multiply them and the answer is 48 so that's the answer that's the number of blue balloons and let's look at another question on ratio in a certain class in a school the ratio of the number of boys to the number of girls is 5 is to 4 now we given that there are 40 boys in this class that's a lot of boys in the class so what is the total number of children that's the question so 40 boys that means we must find the number of girls as well and then we must add up the numbers right so once again we use the idea that we can think of the ratio as five parts to four parts so the 40 boys corresponds to five parts so one part would be 40 over 5 which is 8 so there are 8 children in one part of this ratio so right we don't actually have to find the number of girls separately we can just add up the 5 and 4 that's 9 so there are 9 parts all together 5 plus 4 there are 9 parts okay now one part is 8 so 9 parts would be the total 9 parts would be uh, 9 times 8 which is 72 so that's the total number of children Let's stop here.